Hello! <laughs> I hope you all had a very lovely Christmas, or whatever it is that you celebrate. We are back with the, amongst the, uh, the munching tortoises and the, uh, crawling hermit crabs. <laughs> with State of Love and Trust for Randy Dill, 1981. King Frank, C-Rod, must be A-Rod's third cousin. Matt Klein, Mr. P4NY, and Mr. Brzezinski. I know we've been waiting on this one for a long time. Uh, I put a lot of thought into how I would break this up, by the way. By the way, this is like, you know, those, those tear-off calendars, except I realized when I tore this off to write these notes that this is January 3rd, 2017, so I'm quite a bit behind. It's a baseball one. January 2nd said, uh, um, Yogi Berra, uh, if people don't want to come out to the ballpark, there's nothing we can do to stop them. <laughs> Alright, here we go. State of Love and Trust. So... The first chord is F, but if you're Pearl Jam, you're playing it as a C shape F, so follow my logic. Play a C chord, right? B1, D2, A3, but use your middle ring and pinky fingers instead. Now, you're gonna move that up to where the A string is now the eighth fret, the D string is the seventh fret, and the B string is the sixth fret. This is the eighth fret of the A string, that's an F note, and the A string is the root note of this shape. So, you know, the third fret of the A string is a C, the eighth fret is an F, and our pointer finger takes care of the bar. That's not the easiest thing to do in the world. I suggest using an electric, not an acoustic here. Down, 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 up, down. But on the down, up, down, you, you stop squeezing. Don't let go, just stop squeezing. And then, you move to an A minor, but not here. Here, so it's like you do your power chord, E5, A7, D7, bar it with your pointer finger. That's an A minor. Start with your pinky off, and then put it back on. First strike on the A minor is an upstroke. Down, down, up, up, down. Down, down, up, up, down. Now, if you don't want to go through all that, you can certainly play F. And then A minor here, remove your middle finger. That's an A minor 7 chord. When you take your pinky off, that's an A minor 7 chord. So, same thing. Not quite the same, but pretty much the same. Of course, that's all that happens in the intro. The verse kicks in and Mike starts going And that is thusly. You're just gonna arpeggiate the shape you put all this effort into making, so... A8, D7, B6, G5. And then, bend, G7, G5, D7. Second time! Oops. The G7. G7, G7, release to 5, 7, 5. Third time was the same as the first time, and it just kind of does the chords. It just kind of fancily strums them. Also get those notes done like this. A8, D7, G10, D10. I have tried it both ways and I prefer this way. 
just seems that my fingers communicate with my right hand better as to when and where we're supposed to pluck, but you might like it this way. Or you might figure out another way of place to do it. You can do it there. <laughs> it's just, that's easy. Just like down the F chord. D3, G2, E1, B1, but then you're kind of up, you know, the creek without a paddle for that situation. That's it. That's it for the verse. We only really have the chorus left to do, and I thought, uh, I thought long and hard that we'd do the solos in another video when it wasn't the day after the day after Christmas or Christmas Eve, 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 which is today, of course, 363 Eves. That's not funny. That is not funny. All right, so chorus. The first two chords. C. I'm going to play the power chord. G. A. B. C. D. Half of the chorus, and the first chorus is only the first half of the chorus. So this is where your grandma always brings crappy deviled eggs. It's Christmas time, so she might have. Uh, comes into play the first three dots of the E and the A string: G, A, B, C, D, E. Because we got F, A minor, C, G, A, B, or B, C. And then it goes through the verse again. Uh, there's some guitar twinklies we're not going to discuss because we're going to do that another time. But when the chorus goes twice as long, of course, the second and third time, F, A minor, C, G, A, B, C, D. That was the first half. play that as open chords, that's cool too. F, A minor, C, G, I forgot. A, B is going to be a power chord anyways. C, is it a D major? It's neither. It's a D power chord. We don't hear a third there, but I feel like if it was anything, it would be a D major. How neat. Let's 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 test that theory. I think it would be a D major. If it was anything. That's so weird because the whole thing's in A minor, which would be a D minor. Anyways, state of love and trust. That's all the pieces. You can figure out where to put them, right? We should do that here. We should do that here. Let's do that here. Okay, ready? This is kind of a solo. This might be enough for everybody. We'll see if you want the rest of the solos. Okay, ready? E3. Three, five, 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 three. Now to the B string. Five, 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 three, two, a uh, one open. Three, five, 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 three, B five, five, three, one open. Yeah, so, 
Should we do the uh, rest of the, the solos when it's not Christmas Eve, 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 Eve? Add that to your vocabulary. It's a good one. It takes a while. You practice if you just count in fives. Eve, 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 And you do it, what, 27 times? Was it? I don't know. I was practicing that last week. Because that's what I do in my free time. Anyways, state of love and trust. I hope that was helpful, gentlemen and ladies. And I will see you next time for something else or maybe the solos let me know if you want the crazy solos too we can certainly go through them happy holidays happy new year goodbye <laughs>